Canon's second big announcement for NAB 2015 is a rather odd looking new 4K camera called the XC10. Let's check it out. Linus Tech Tips coverage of NAB 2015 is powered by Sennheiser, Kingston SD cards, and Lynda.com. The XC10 is the smallest addition to the Canon cinema line. Ergonomically, the camera looks like a hybrid between a DSLR and a camcorder, so it's relatively easy to hold in the hand. The grip is rotatable up to 90 degrees and the touchscreen monitor on the back of the camera can be pulled out and positioned upward or downward depending on your shooting situation. On the right hand side of the camera it has a mic jack, HDMI out, USB and a DC power in. The X-C10 has a 1 inch size sensor which is comparable to many premium point and shoot cameras. It shoots 8-bit 4K video to CFast 2.0 cards internally and has a fixed lens that has a 10 times optical zoom and a slightly disappointing f2.8 to 5.6 aperture. This means, like most point-and-shoot cameras, this camera loses light as you zoom in. The strangest thing to me is that the camera is priced at $2,499, and for a camera targeted at pros and people just starting out in video, the specs are a tad disappointing at that price point. With its choice of CFast 2.0 and its price point, prosumers might seriously consider other camera options in this range. Thank you to Sennheiser for sending us here this year. Check out bit.ly slash Sennheiser for all their new releases. Also, Kingston SD cards for all your personal and professional needs. Check out bit.ly slash Kingston NAB. And lynda.com slash NAB is where you can learn to become a content creator yourself with all their great video editing and camera tutorials. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please let me know in the comments down below or on the forum what you think of the XC10. Where do you think it fits in the current camera market?